welcome to this week's episode of The Runner. For the second time this season, the Sunshine State has delivered a win for the Saints and comeback victories are starting to become a trademark for this young group. Let's take a look back at the week that was. The first day of winter brought a sharp contrast to the balmy Brisbane climate for the players recovering in the bay on Monday. The icy water wasn't the only thing keeping the team on its toes. I feel like you're never safe out on the ground, whether you're 10 goals up or 2 goals up, you just, you just never know what could happen, so you just always just keep playing the game plan and you can't um, stop yeah, giving your all because yeah, at any second they can just come back and um, take it off you. The Saints' current form is winning a lot of fans over, including naysayer David King, who tweeted this earlier in the week. What's going on here? Josh King, how are you, mate? Going well. Got a little membership pack here for you, mate. Uh, <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> Heard you many a word, so I, I, I thought we'd sign you up. He's a little scarf. And a, uh... He hasn't got a bulldog. On Thursday, the Susan Day Group joined the Saints as a sponsor and Jack Stephen marked his 100th game ahead of the weekend as the icing on the cake. Susan Day Group have come on board um, as a sponsor, so we're wrapped as a club. The sponsors are uh, joining us on our journey, and so um, that, is the, that is also the reason for the cake, so it's not just about about Jack, but um, they will be uh, on, on our on our shorts, and they'll also be on our on our backdrop. So we're just wrapped to have such a significant sponsor on board. The AFL Hall of Fame on Thursday night saw two St Kilda stalwarts recognised, with Tony Lockett elevated to AFL legend status, and Spud finally got to finish his infamous speech from 2010. Saints fans knew long before that Anthony Howard plugged Lockett was not a superstar, but a superhero. It's a home game against the Hawks on Sunday as we vie for the annual Blue Ribbon Cup. Pre-game stars from yesteryear will line up at Etihad Stadium for the annual Legends match, so make sure you get there early with gates open from 2.15pm to see the likes of Lenny Hayes, Aaron Hamill and Shane Warne take to the ground. I'm Bree Gallagher from all of us here at the Saints. Have a great footy weekend.